Hi, I'm Dale Dunn with Premier Farm Realty Group, and we're here in the Rocky Mountains. And uh, but even though I'm out here, I'm thinking about food plots back in the Midwest because it's that time of the year. And uh, in just a moment, Premier Farm Realty Group's very own Larry Woodward is going to talk to you about a very important yet often overlooked aspect of planting food plots. Take a look. Food plots, food plots, food plots. You know, that's all you hear in the deer world these days because a lot of people are managing more than ever for deer. Nutrition, attraction. There's so many different variables to go into producing a great food plot. You know, it's not easy, but like the people at Whitetail Institute of North America will tell you or anybody else, there's one thing, the most important thing any of us can do, and that's to get a soil test. You know, a lot of people, you know, when it gets time to plant a food plot, they'll go out there and they'll work up the ground and get it ready to go and throw some fertilizer on and plant their seeds, hope for rain and see what they get. But more times than not, when they do things in that fashion, they don't get a quality product. Now, it takes time and money for seed and fertilizer and your time and wear and tear on equipment. This is where a soil test will pay back the fruits of your labor. A soil test provides existing soil fertility index and current pH, which is very important for all plants to be able to utilize the fertilizer that you put on correctly for the plants that you have put in. It also provides lime and fertilizer requirements needed for high crop yields. The reports are very easy to follow, and if you have any questions, you can get those answered quickly with a toll-free call to one of the specialists at the Whitetail Institute of North America.